Peace y'all, welcome back to my channel. I'm Camelia and I create holistic lifestyle content. And today, today I want to share with y'all the items that I have so far for my baby boy that I'll be having in less than two weeks. I'm ready, y'all. So, before we get started, if you are new here, thank you so much for joining me. Go ahead and subscribe to my channel because I know you're going to like my videos already. And if you're not new here, thank you so much for joining me. Hey, y'all. So, let's get into the video. Lego. So... I don't have like any particular order or anything that I'm going to be sharing these items with y'all in. I'm just going to share. Yeah. So a lot of these items I ordered off of Amazon. I made my baby registry using Amazon and also a few items from Target. But majority of everything is coming from or has come from Amazon. So I have a blanket here. It's Burst Bees. It's a reversible blanket. And this is just gonna be used to throw over the baby, to put over the baby while he's sleeping in his cute little bassinet that'll be here. I can't remember when my mom said, but yeah, that'll be here soon enough. Like on Amazon, if you create a baby registry, um, they will, and you have to do something else. I can't remember the other qualification, but they will send you like a little, baby registry gift bag and so they sent me one and they sent this swaddle blanket here i love swaddle blankets <laughs> i had so many swaddle blankets with hadassah and i use them for probably everything like for the baby like everything literally and so yeah i got that swaddle blanket and then i ordered this thing here this is a car seat cover so i don't know if y'all have seen but like they have the covers that can go all the way around the car seat. So when you get out the car with the baby, the baby is entirely covered and it has a little air hole on top as well. So the baby can still breathe or whatever. But you can also use this to cover up while nursing as well. I won't use it that way. It'll just be for the car seat. Then I got one little small 32 pack of newborn size diapers because yeah, when Hadassah was born, she was like five. 0.5 ounces and a size one diaper was not gonna fit her little self and so i am anticipating baby boy to be small as well and so i got one 32 pack of newborn diapers uh disposable diapers as well now, i am gonna be cloth diapering also i'm gonna do mostly cloth diapering but i'm gonna mix it with disposies as well um for like nighttime probably and then like being like being on the go or whatever just to make it easier um, for myself. And I got, what is this? Hold on. And I'm taking this stuff out because I'm gonna wash everything as well. So these are some muslin cloths, like, you know, burping the baby, throwing the baby over my shoulder and things like that. So got some muslin birthing cloths. I love the muslin material, like I said. Swaddle blankets are the same. And so in that same Amazon kit, Amazon welcome, baby welcome registry bag, whatever it's called, they give you um, a size one diaper in there. So yeah, I have that. I don't want to use that because I don't need it. And the material, it's not like the Honest brand. I specifically have the Honest brand because of how it's made, the material it's made with and all that. What I was saying, my granny called, but uh yeah moving on <laughs> got some socks for him little cute socks they're so cute i think we got these from either target or oshkosh one of them those are pretty much the only two places i have went to target Oshkosh and then order stuff off of Amazon. Oh yeah, so those socks are from Target because Cloud Island is a Target brand. So yeah, I got some washcloths as well. Terry cloth, washcloths for the baby. 
It's like what, 12 in a pack? Yeah, so 12 of these in there. Got some little hats here for him. I'm like, I don't know how big his head is gonna be. Ain't no telling. Uh, but yeah, got some little hats for him here. So cute. Less than two weeks, y'all, and I get to hold my baby. So cute are these baby kimono gowns with the side snap. Now with Dasa, this is all I had really for like the first several months for her. Like, and then some friends had gifted us some onesies, like the onesie zips that are like full body coverage had gifted us those. But as far as what we had bought, we had literally a bunch of these. I had like, I had over 12 of these. I probably had like 15 of these. And that was what she wore like majority of the first several months. And they literally lasted all the way up until she was like, seven months old like she was still in those probably longer than that and so i like these specifically because of the side snap so i don't have to put anything over the baby's head i can just snap right here i don't have to zip anything and also and also it has the little mitten at the end so i just fold this over and then it's like a mitten at the end so i love 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 baby gown kimonos like i love them and so at the bottom like i said it's a gown so it's just open here and so his legs can be out or whatever and so yeah definitely able to just grow into this on and on and on still able to wear it even as a newborn baby um because it'll just cover him like it's just like he has a blanket on almost he's swaddled almost <laughs> not swaddled but yeah you get what i'm saying so yeah i'm so glad i got these um i wasn't able to find the company that I got them for Hadassah from, I have no idea what the name of that company was. And I tried to find it in my emails and I couldn't find it. So yeah, got these off of Amazon. I definitely love, love, love these. And also because I'm gonna be doing a Lotus birth. So the belly button, um, the cord, the umbilical cord is gonna be still attached. And so I needed to make sure it wasn't something that was gonna like cover it all the way and have to tuck in because I wasn't gonna be able to do it. So at least with this, I can like, it's an opening here. And so the umbilical cord can just literally come through the opening and be open right here. So it won't be like um, closed off or anything like that. So yep, got these, it's three of these in here. I'm actually gonna get some more of these, probably the same ones. From Oshkosh, I got these little cute pants. I got two, two, two packs of these. Just some pants to put on them, you know, going somewhere. Throw these little cute little pants on them. And I'm like, they're so small, like these little cute joggers. That's so tiny, oh my goodness. Uh, and then I got these t-shirts here. Again, with the side snap, because I don't like putting anything over a baby's head. I just don't. I don't know. I just don't. If I don't have to, then I won't. So, yeah, I got the side snap shirts for him. And, of course, like I said, the umbilical cord can just be, his belly can be free and all that until the umbilical cord falls off. So, it's like, what, five in here, four in the pack right here. And then I got these onesies which i don't even know if he's even gonna wear them because when i bought them i was like crap the umbilical cord won't be able to be free in these because yeah it's a onesie it snaps at the bottom so but they were a dollar fifty i got these from once upon a child and they look really really crisp and clean and they look new honestly so yeah but i may not be able to wear these i don't know Maybe after the umbilical cord falls off, depends on how long it takes. I can't remember how long it took for Dasa. But yeah, depends on how long it takes, he may be able to wear these onesies here. And it says zero to three months. So I don't know, they don't really look like three months, but we'll see. So got five, yeah, got five of these onesies. Then I got this here, this onesie. This is three months. I don't have a lot of stuff that is like on the larger side, honestly, but I did get a few items. And this is from Oshkosh. They have great sales at Oshkosh all the time. Like literally like 40% off, sometimes even 70% off. 
Then I got these, these are six months. So I got a few items that are larger in size for later on when he grows. I just already have some stuff on hand. Got more socks. Got these from Oshkosh as well. Little baby socks and they have a the little grip on the, on the back of them. So tiny, it's so cute. Onesies. And these don't have the legs part connected. So yeah, these are three months size here. Got four in the pack. And I just thought these colors were really, really cute. Just look at them. So cute. I love these colors. But yeah, got these. Then I got two of these nice, soft um, onesies with the footies attached to them as well. And this is a size three months. Now, I'm thinking that during that time, it, it may have started to get warm outside. Just thinking now. But I don't know. Maybe he can fit it before time. Yeah, I got two of these. One says little brother on it. So, yeah, so cute. I got this blanket too. I just love emerald green. May baby. So, yeah. Love my emerald green, forest green, <laughs> green green, nature green. Yeah. This nice soft. Oh, it's so soft. It's so soft. And it's a nice size. It should be able to go like inside of his like baby crib bed when he gets to that stage, probably like six months or something like that. So it should be able to fit over that. And so that was part of the reason why I got it as well. So he can use it now, but also use it later as well. So yeah, it's really, really soft. And I got this off of Amazon. Oh, uh, this is the baby's towels. Okay, so yeah, baby towels. It came with two in the pack. So you know how it comes. <laughs> you have where you put the baby's head right here and then you just you just swaddle them in it like that. So yeah, got two of those, gray and white. Then I got this four pack of swaddle blankets here. Um, I love swaddle blankets. I can use them for so many things. So yeah, I got this four pack of swaddle blankets here. I love swaddle blankets. Oh, I can't wait. It's almost time. And this is a really nice size, actually. So, and it's still actually folded. <laughs> so this is a really nice size swaddle blanket. Um, yeah. Get some of these swaddle blankets. Amazon, okay. And I got some water wipes. Now I was gonna do the cloth wipes, but I think I want to just go water wipes. It's just water as far as the ingredients. And so I used this with Hadassah and they work great. Didn't cause any problems or anything. It's no sense or any extra things. It's literally a water wipe. It's 99.9% .9 water. <laughs> and so I'll be using these wipes for him with the Sposy and with the Sposy diapers and also the cloth diapers. Oh, I got some more pants too. So these actually, these pants are six months pants. So yeah, it'll be later down the line, summertime. Then I got some nursing pads, some nipple covers. Um, Yeah, for leakage and things like that. There are a lot of them in here. <laughs> Let me see. One, two, three, four. So I think it's like eight pair in here. So yeah, I got these for me since I will be nursing. Then I got some butt paste, um, just to kind of have on hand already, max strength. I think I tried this with Dasa when she had like a diaper rash or whatever, and it worked. Then I got another one as well, the Earth Mama Baby brand diaper balm. Got this one as well. Just so I can kind of have these things already on hand. Then I got some Earth Mama nipple butter. This is gonna be for my nipples when nursing because y'all know if you if you have breastfed, your nipples be sore. <laughs> so yeah, I had to make sure I got some of that. I also have coconut oil as well already on hand. More water wipes. I think I got those from Target. When I went to the store, my granny, I just grabbed an extra another one because yeah, I'm gonna need a lot of wipes. Then this is the soap that I'm gonna be using. This is my all-time favorite soap, Dr. Bronner's soap. 
Baby Unscented. Yeah, this is my favorite soap. So Hadassah and I use this soap as well. We all will just use soap, like this soap, because yeah, everybody in the house can use this soap. And this is the one that I particularly like, and I've been using it with Hadassah since she was a baby also. So yeah, Dr. Bronner's Baby Unscented Castor Soap. Then this little onesie came in the Amazon registry gift kit. I, I've been calling it so many different names, but yeah, this one came in that. Then I got some Sitz Bath Salt for me for after I have baby boys so I can soak. Um, it's for hemorrhoid care. And with Hadassah, I actually, I didn't tear. I didn't have any hemorrhages or anything like that. So I am hoping and praying for the same experience. But this is still going to get used for the healing process. Um, so yeah, I got this off of Amazon and it had really, really great reviews. I don't think I did one at all. I don't think I did a sits bath with Hadassah at all, but yeah, I got this for this time and it has lots of herbs in it. I'll just tell you what's in it because I was really attracted to the ingredients. So Epsom salt, dead sea salt, baking soda, coconut oil, witch hazel, Go to cola, organic turmeric, yarrow, organic chamomile, organic frankincense, nettle leaf, horse chestnut, aloe vera, vitamin C, organic lemon oil, organic ginger oil, organic <laughs> lavender, calendula, tea tree oil, and water. So those are the ingredients, like great ingredients. So yes, this is what I'm gonna use for my zip bag after I have baby boy. Also in that Amazon kit came a pacifier, Aquaphor, what is this? Cetaphil, I don't know. And a coupon. And then also for the um, home birth as well, like there are certain items that I had to get for the home birth experience. I'm having a home birth, I have a midwife, and there are certain items that you know, need to be on hand at the house when I go in labor. So when the midwives get here, they can get everything set up so that I can have a proper birthing experience. It's clean and you know, all of that stuff. We got some witch hazel wipes and these items I just went to Target and got. Got some witch hazel wipes. This will be for, for perennial care. So if I tear in the event that I do tear, I have these on hand to use to help with my healing. Some hydrogen peroxide and alcohol for cleanup. Then I got some maxi pads for after. I got the super large ones. I've never worn these like for a menstrual cycle, but yeah, I had to get the super large ones for after having a baby. So got a bag of these. The most important item. <laughs> or a home birth. I got this huge bag of protective underpants. It's like the little floor mats. They go on the floor and they catch, um, they're used to catch the amniotic fluids that come out while I am birthing baby boy. So yeah, I got a big bag of these. It's 30 in here and they're pretty large size. And so yeah, my midwife was glad that I got big ones and I that it came with uh, that I got a 30 pack as well. Cause she's like, yeah, you're gonna need a lot of those. Like some people just bring five. Like so, she said one of her births she just did, um, she only had five and she's like five, that is not enough. So yeah, I got that. Cause yeah, we wanna make sure all the amniotic fluid does not hit the floor and that it hits this instead and anything else that comes out. Now I'm not sure if I'm going to pump or not. With Hadassah, she didn't take a pacifier and she did not take a bottle. She wasn't interested in either of those things. She just wanted me, like literally. She would spit pacifier out, bottle, oop, she didn't want either. So I actually ended up only pumping, like literally for like, like a couple weeks or yeah, probably like a few weeks, literally a few weeks. And after that, it was just all on demand. Well, it was on demand anyway. Like I don't even know if I use the pumped milk um, much at all, honestly. But yeah, so I have a breast pump here. This is the same breast pump 
that I had then actually. And it still has some new pieces in here. Um, so, yeah, I have a whole breast pump here in this bag. This is the one that, the electric one. And then I also have the manual one as well. I remember using both when I was pumping with Hadassah. And yeah, of course, the other one works a lot better, but I did use the hand one sometimes. So yeah, I do have breast pumps on hand in the event that I do use them. It's very possible that I will just do on demand, just like I did with Hadassah. I honestly prefer it and it works for me. So yeah, we'll see. Now, when it comes to like, like my mom or something wanting to uh, keep the baby or whatever, like that's where it got kind of challenging because she wasn't able to keep Hadassah like without me being nearby because yeah, when she needed to nurse, I had to be there, which like I said, I'm okay with. We'll see with baby boy if he takes to a bottle or if I pump or not. I don't know what I'm going to do, but I do have breast pumps on hand in the event that I do. And I will more than likely use mason jars to store. I have some mason jars already, but I need to get the small little four ounce mason jars. That's what I really want to get. If I do the bottles, I will use the four ounce mason jars for to store the milk. And also they got it to where you can add a lid. Uh, I mean, you can add the nipple on there now with the top for bottle feeding as well. So yeah, some of the items that I have talked about, they can be found in my Amazon storefront. I will link that below. This is my baby item haul so far. I still got diapers with, with my aunt and my mom. She ordered the, the bassinet and yeah. So, and I still some other items like I, that I still have to get like car seat. Those are all the items that I got. And I'm like, look, if I don't get anything else, I got breast milk. It's already here, <laughs> already here and in action as of a long time ago. And I have a roof over my head and I have food in the kitchen. So I literally have everything that I need in the event that I don't get any other items. For baby boy, for my birthing experience, I've got all that I literally need right here. So yeah, I want to thank you guys so much for watching this video. Hope you enjoyed this video. Give this video a thumbs up. And let me know in the comments if there are some things that you think like, oh, you should get this. Oh, you probably forgot about this. Oh, this may be helpful for this. Like, let me know in the comments if there are any items like such because I still have some time to get them. And I could definitely be missing something. Like, I know for sure I want to get like the, um, the baby wrap. I had one with Hadassah and it was great for when I was in the kitchen cooking. It was great for our everyday walk. So I know I need to get that. That's on my baby registry as well. I do need to get that. But yeah, I will also link the baby registry below as well. So yep. Thank y'all for being here. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see y'all in the next one. Peace friends.